What is up guys, this is Tails Channel and welcome to part 1 of Sonic Before the Sequel Aftermath. The game after before the sequel, or was that after the sequel? I, I don't even know, but <laughs> what's up? I got a uh, gear, also known as Gregory Harris from the Game Troops. What is up, man? Hey guys, it's Greg, also known as Gear from the Game Troops, and it's great to be here. Um, some of you guys may actually know me, I was previously known as Alpha 12 from the Alpha Gamers, but hey, we're now the Game Troops, so thanks for having me. And alright, we're gonna jump right in here, and we are in Sunset Something Zone. I didn't have <laughs> enough time to read that, but basically this game is more exploration than anything. It's more like, it's more like you collect the items to get to different places, and... It's actually, I played some of it before um, we're recording this now, and it's actually pretty fun. I know there's going to be some aspects that will get you guys mad if you're, you know, just a classic purist in general. But, I mean, if you're looking for a good time, um, you're looking for a good game to play, I suggest this one and before the sequel. <laughs> well, it, it definitely looks nice. Oh, yes, it does. And, alright, so let's get into the action. As you guys see those bars, we can't go in there yet. But, I'll show you how later. But, I mean... So, what are your impressions of this game so far? Um... Well, I've commented with you before on Sonic Before the Sequel, and as I've stated before, I'm not the biggest fan of fan games. There's only a few that I actually like, which is, well, Sonic Before the Sequel. Um, then I like, what's it called? Uh, Sonic Mega Mix, my favorite of all time. And now I'm looking at this one, and it's like, hmm, I don't know. I think, I think now fans are starting to improve their game and show that they're being serious when it comes to actually... Um, making their fan games and things like that because previously before I just hated it like everybody just either they never finished it or it just was crap or it just ugh. yeah so there's I mean this one just this guy I swear uh, can't remember his name what what is his name Lake Pepper Lake Pepper yeah this one? that's it yeah yeah the, yep, yep, yep 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 that guy <laughs> um, <laughs> this guy yeah he does a fantastic job with this and honestly what I can say here is that Sega take notes. <laughs> uh, nope, red herring. <laughs> whatever. It doesn't matter to me. I, I find the whole red herring thing to just be a little pun towards whatever. I, I don't find it to be much of a rumor, but whatever. Same here. Well, I think we're coming closer to actually something that is cool. It's, oh, these giant motobugs. I hate them. Come on. <laughs> die. Die. All right. There you go. And let's see if we're there yet. I... I forget if we're there. Oh, yep. Here's some bird things that we're gonna talk to you, and I'll read it. I'm hungry. Still <laughs> hungry. Okay. They get some okay. food, you lazy bum. Hey, yeah. you. What are you mm -hmm. doing here? Period. Question what? mark. And then Sonic uh, what? says, I don't know. What so you were searching for something you saw just a while ago? Anyways, mm -hmm. I've got a question for you. I'm searching for a new home around here, and this place seems like a good place. I, I don't even know what I'm reading. So, do you have any idea what is and happened in the first place? Oh, Eggman? Heh. I should have known. Alright, don't worry about <laughs> me. I can take care of some badniks. Okay, oh, totally. I've got some stuff to do now. I'll say you later. Just <laughs> like S-E. But, yeah. you're not doing anything. You... You just said you had stuff to do. You know what? Whatever. But Lake Feppard isn't exactly English, so I understand why he made some grammatical errors, and it doesn't really mind me. Matter. Yeah, yeah it doesn't really matter. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, oh well. It's the gameplay that matters, because honestly, I can be given a very crappy story for Sonic. Like, uh, um, you know, just like something really crappy, like <coughs> Sonic Generations, the dialogue was bad. Whoa, thought that was but, bad? How about <laughs> Sonic 06? <laughs> well, it, you know, like, the, the dialogue-wise, like, uh, the story could be as bad as it can get, but the gameplay is what matters mm -hmm. to me, honestly. I know, right? And Sonic 06 showed us none of that, so let's get off the topic for four likes. From likers from Sonic 06. Let's let yeah, let's let's step off the topic before people that are watching this video right now click the back button. I see you. I see you moving your mouse. Don't click the back button. Don't <laughs> don't leave the video. Stay here. 
Oh my god, <laughs> Sonic and Elise kiss was perfectly normal. You know, I see hedgehogs and humans kissing all the time, and I live in New York. <laughs> that, well, that explains uh, it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let, moving on. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, we just moved into a new zone, and mm -hmm. in the next zone, we're going to get something pretty beneficial that some of you are going to love, some of you are going to hate. I'm like, who cares? This is actually pretty cool. And, yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. this game, if you're a classic purist, I don't suggest playing it just because you'll get butthurt very easily. Just because, <laughs> you know, you're, you're just... I don't know why why do you and uh people who just want to play a good sonic game i guess go ahead this is a really cool game i mean lake feppard is amazing he does certainly prove that he can do a good job as long as he puts the dedication and effort towards it i'm like and no offense to any of you guys that try to do a sonic fan game or film or whatever but if you really show the dedication and effort towards something you can get it done and uh, it's just like another thing take your time I swear and I, and I applaud Lake Pepper for taking his time with this project like with after the sequel before the sequel any game or any project that he works on he takes his time which is what I really enjoy out of this guy this guy really shows that hey I can do a high quality project but it's just gonna take time you guys are all gonna have to be patient so suck it <laughs> <laughs> all right let's talk to this red bird right here oh yes we have made a little home here how much time we will stay here, well, I don't know. Until we find a better place, I guess. Eggman destroyed our original home, so why not take his? Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, by the way, do you know that this place is called Flower Mountain Land? <laughs> they say it's because it is shaped a plain landscape surrounded by mountains. Looks like a flower is seen from space. Yeah, I kind of skipped. Still an <laughs> evil plot? I don't know. <laughs> oh man, here it is. <laughs> oh man, what can it be? What can it be? You guys are gonna get so mad if you're purists. Sonic has a sword. What? A sword. Uh, what? Oh my god, Sonic has a sword! Wow, this is this is the most <laughs> awful game I have ever seen. Just because Sonic, oh, and he runs like modern Sonic when he has the sword. So I, I'm, oh my god. No, oh, calm down. Wait, wait, what? He, what? He's given a sword. What? What? What for? I don't know. It, it, it's again. It's one of those games where you collect the items, and I guess the sword is one of those items. But now we can break through this wire stuff. Finally. Wait, you use the sword to break through the wires? Yeah. What? Exactly. This is Sonic and the Black Knight all over again. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool. I mean, aside from the fact that most fans are gonna complain cause he has a short and he's running like a modern Sonic. Um, I... Cause he has a short, he's running like a modern Sonic. <laughs> Nobody gives two craps about what you have to say because you know what, I'm gonna swing with my sling, sling slim gym that Kobe doesn't have. Oh, okay. Okay, <laughs> if you're watching Kobe, I hope you, <laughs> you don't hate Greg after Sonic, that. Sonic is swinging with your slim gym. <laughs> oh my goodness, okay. So let's continue. <laughs> <laughs> and modern Sonic will, um, I'll, I'll try to use the sword as less as possible, guys, just because I know there's some people out there who are going to be mad for some reason. But at the beginning of the game, it says, if you are pissed off at this project, you are a freaking fan boy. And I agree. <laughs> I mean, this is just an experiment, so get used to it. But we're going to stop complaining about the complainers now, and we're going to talk right. about the actual aspects. So, right. basically, go. we're going to, um, we're just going to get through the stage, and um, I think after this, we're going to end it. Okay. So, let's get through here. We're going to destroy these badniks and be all cool with our super Excalibur sword, or it's not even Excalibur, it's like red. It's like a lava it, dagger. It, you know what? You know what it? You know what it is? It's the freaking uh, what's it called? The uh, the fairy sword. If it's big, it's the fairy sword from Zelda. No, oh, it's pretty small actually. I mean, look oh, at it. Oh, oh, okay. It's like a. Well it's done. like it's kind of like a dagger. So then it's definitely Kobe Slim Jim. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> so I mean, I guess that's it. We're gonna uh leave us here in Lost Liquid Zone because this game is just one game. There's no really different zones. So we're uh -huh. just going to end it right here. 
And all okay. right, so thank you all for watching part one of Before the Sequel Aftermath. I really had fun recording that part. And Gear, also known as Greg, also known as Alpha 12, also known as that kid who sucks. Do you have well, anything I'm else you want to say? <laughs> <laughs> no longer Alpha 12, that's for sure. But hey, yes, I am Greg, also known as Gear on um, the Game Troops. And if you guys enjoyed my commentary, which was by not impressive at the slightest in my opinion <laughs> but if you enjoyed my commentary with matt today on aftermath go check out game troops we're the brand new channel we're basically the alpha gamers but reborn into something better so higher quality better stuff more consistent uploads all that stuff if you loved alpha gamers you're gonna love game troops so give us a like and subscribe all right so we'll see you guys next time with part two see ya